is back. You might call it the school of life. Some East Valley teens learning the hard way. There's no excuse for cutting class. The Mesa School District has been working with a justice court judge, punishing kids who consistently blow off class. So they face fines, community service, and in some cases, the loss of their driver's license. Andrew has been live now at the start. I mean, they're hitting these kids where it hurts, Andrew. Yeah, they sure are, Troy. Taking away a driver's license is a big deal to somebody who's about to turn 16. Arizona law requires kids go to class, and the law requires that they be in that class 90% of the time. Truancy officers here in Mesa say they save the worst cases for the judge. By the time the students get to the judge, most of them have well over a dozen absences. They come in with their parents, and the judge does not like excuses. He gets sick some, and I think sometimes he gets lazy. If you're really right. ill that many times, get a medical professional to work with you. If it's just because you don't feel like going to school, that's not sick. The judge does not hold back, even when the students tell him what they want to do when they're adults. You're not going to graduate from high school if you keep missing this much school. And you're not going to get in college, and you certainly won't get through college with this kind of, uh, of a study and work ethic. It ain't going to happen. You got a choice here. The program gets excellent results because the punishments are not just a slap on the wrist. This is not just a, a chat with the counselor. They're now dealing with the legal system. They're now looking at a class three criminal misdemeanor. They need to recognize that this is something that can impact the rest of their lives. With more than 70,000 students, Mesa's is the largest district in the state. Truancy is a big problem, but they're fighting back. The judge's orders are simple, go to school, have good grades. If you do that, we drop the charge. Tim Pinsonault has about a dozen truancy officers working to get kids back in class. The worst cases go before the judge, and it works. We have one of the schools that the child was a lot of discipline for a lot of problems. She went through this program. Complete attitude change. She's doing great, great grades. Attitude is great with teachers, and attendance she hasn't missed. Truancy officers here in Mesa last year, last school year, warned 1,900 students. 600 of those students ended up going to court. And as you heard them say, if they follow the judge's orders and they clean up their act, the charges against them are usually dropped. Reporting live in Mesa, I'm Andrew Hasman, Fox 10 News. Next. Well, some beautiful weather starting to warm up a little bit, but it sure is 